From testing the best water slides from all over the globe, to getting paid to play with Lego all day long, we take a look at 15 of the most amazing jobs in the world. Number 15. World of Warcraft Tester Do you play World of Warcraft? And if so, do you play well? Can you farm 200 gold an hour and hit level 80 in under two weeks? If the answer is yes, you can apply for the job that about 12 million players only dream about as a World of Warcraft game tester. There are in fact several Blizzard jobs posted on their website. The Blizzard Employment Database has dozens of jobs available, mostly World of Warcraft employment opportunities. They are currently hiring for several game tester positions for World of Warcraft under the QA department. Number 14. Wine Tester and Blogger Imagine moving to the heart of Sonoma County, where every day you'll come home to more than 450 wineries along the beautiful northern coast of California. Picture living rent-free, learning the intricacies of making the perfect wine, and capturing and sharing the entire experience for your network of Twitter followers. Now imagine getting paid $10,000 a month to do it. Hardy Wallace of Atlanta, the first person to submit his application, was the winner of the position at Murphy Good Winery. A $10,000 per month for six months rent-free job updating Twitter and Facebook with his winery live stream. Number 13. Bike Rider Photographer for Google Maps Google has hired two lucky young men to ride around France on dopey-looking tricycles snapping up photos of historical sites that are inaccessible by car. This three-wheeler is a site with its long pole holding nine cameras, a GPS, a computer, and a generator. But the contraption tooling around the French capital needs all that gear to do its job, adding three-dimensional images to Google's Street View maps. The riders, wearing Google t-shirts and white helmets, are visiting well-known sites such as the Chateau de Versailles, west of Paris, the Jardin du Luxembourg on the city's left bank, or Leal, in the busy center of the French capital. Number 12. Beer Tasters Maybe not one for everyone, but if you prefer beer to chocolate, then many breweries hire technologists to check the quality of their drink before it goes on sale. In order to thrive in this job, you have to have an adept palate, and that doesn't mean being able to sink six pints on a Friday night. It's still a pretty popular job. When Welsh brewery Evan Evans started the search for a group of beer tasters to help with the development of a new beer range, the company received more than 250 applications. Number 11. Airplane Repo Man If you like adventure and high-stress work, then this could be the high-paying job for you. Aircraft repossessees can get a 6 to 10% commission on the resale of the plane they get back for the bank. For planes costing millions of dollars, that could add up to 600,000 pounds per plane. You need to be prepared for tough work though, as some repo men get shot at or even thrown into foreign prisons. Maybe a safer way to get closer to planes might either be to work as a pilot or get a job in the cabin crew. Number 10. Hotel Reviewer Getting to stay at some of the most amazing destinations around the world while being put up in the location's top hotel for absolutely free is a job we can't help but be envious of. Hotel reviewers will be sure to receive five-star treatment when they're reviewing hotels for magazines and website publications. Number 9. Professional Zombie For some people, Jumping out from behind a corner to scare friends never stops being funny. And for those annoying people who love to scare others, being employed as a professional zombie in the London Dungeons could be the ideal occupation. The London Dungeons experience currently employs 50 staff members to dress up as the living dead and scare visitors as they walk through the doors. Number 8. Director of Fun at a Museum a six-year-old boy who wanted to become the director of York's National Railway Museum landed himself a job as the director of fun. The ambitious youngster got a plum role at the National Railway Museum after applying to replace retiring boss Andrew Scott. Sam Poynton sent a handwritten letter headed, Application for Director, asking for an interview at the center in York. The letter listed his credentials for the role, including his expertise on his train set. I am only six, but I think I can do this job," wrote Sam. The staff was so impressed, they appointed Sam as an honorary director of fun. Number 7. Lego Sculptor Lego has a number of certified professionals who work with the company to create sets and build models for them. They work against fairly tight budgets and thematic constraints, and are based in Legoland discovery centers around the world. But competition for these jobs is fierce, with estimates varying as to exactly how many there are in the world, from 9 to 30. 
The latest one to get a job was 23-year-old Andrew Johnson, who submitted a clever video, then competed in a hardcore three-round build-off, allegedly fighting off 45 other competitors. Number 6. Chocolate Consultant This could well be the ultimate job for anyone with even the smallest craving for chocolate. And yes, jobs like these really do exist. There's lots of different types of chocolate consultants too, from people that work with high street brands and liaise directly with their outlets, to people that work with more niche brands. Louise Thomas had worked in the chocolate industry for two years and had been passionate about chocolate for more than six years. She became frustrated by the lack of education and awareness regarding fine chocolate, so she started her own company to share her love for the cocoa bean. She now runs events and tastings, similar to wine tastings, as well as doing consultancy for hospitality and retail to find a particular chocolate for a client or to extend their existing range. Number 5. Luxury Bed Tester A student from Birmingham City University has landed her dream job. Literally, sleeping on the job and having a lie-in will no longer be a problem for a girl who has been selected to test out luxury beds for a month and get paid for it. Royzen Madigan, age 22, is earning 1,000 pounds to sleep in designer beds every day for a month. The student is helping with a sleep survey carried out by luxury bed specialist Simon Horn. The company sells luxury Savoy beds, originally made for the Savoy Hotel. General Manager Craig Roylands said Royzen will not only provide an objective view of the beds on sale, but will also be a part of a look into what brings a good night's sleep. Number 4. Condom Tester an Australian manufacturer called for applications for what it claims could be the world's best job. Condom tester. Durex marketing manager Sam White was hiring Australians over the age of 18 who could apply for one of 200 positions as a condom tester. Unfortunately, the position is not paid, but successful applicants would receive a free $60 selection of Durex products and will be required to provide the company with honest feedback about the product's performance. One of the lucky 200 testers would win a $1,000 bonus. Maybe the bonus isn't that great, but one thing's for sure. It's a job where employees won't mind taking their work home and burning the midnight oil. Number 3. Candy Taster Another one of the world's best jobs has gone to schoolboy Harry Wilshire, age 12, chief taster in a sweet factory. Harry's job is to test top secret recipes. He got the job after winning a contest at Swizzle's Matlow to find a recruit. According to him, after his first tour at his new job, he felt like having stepped into the book of Charlie and the Chocolate Factory. He wowed judges by describing the flavor and smell of his favorite sweet, the drumstick lolly. The Derby Firm, which also makes Love Hearts, Rainbow Drops, and Parma Violets, has now given the youngster chief taster overalls and business cards. Number 2. Resort Water Slide Tester Tommy Lynch has traveled over 27,000 miles this year for his job testing holiday resort water slides. Mr. Lynch, age 29, works for holiday giant First Choice, checking the height, speeds, water quantity, and landing of the flumes, as well as all the safety aspects. In 2008, Mr. Lynch tested water slides at holiday villages in Lanzarote, Majorca, Egypt, Turkey, Costa del Sol, Cyprus, Algarve, Dominican Republic, and Mexico. This year, he will quality control First Choice's new splash resorts in Greece, Turkey, Florida, Jamaica, and Ibiza. Number 1. Paradise Island Caretaker Ben Southall, age 34, of Pesterfield, beat out nearly 35,000 applicants from around the world for the dream assignment to swim, explore, and relax on Hamilton Island in the Great Barrier Reef. While writing a blog to promote the area, he was selected for the $111,000 gig for a six-month contract to serve as a caretaker of a tropical Australian island. He now has to live rent-free in a three-bedroom villa, complete with pool. Before getting the job, he had to spend four days on the island for an extended interview process, which required applicants to snorkel through crystalline waters, gorge themselves at a beachside barbecue, and relax at a spa. Now that has to be one of the most amazing jobs in the world. Which one of these jobs would you apply for? Let us know in the comments down below. And don't forget to subscribe for more videos every week.